Hey, it's Tony Curl here, and welcome to another episode of our What Dumb Leaders Do series. Dumb leaders play favourites. They, they play favourites, and they play favourites for a multitude of reasons. It may be that they cheer on the same football team, that they've got a greater connection, that they've got close friends, or, or they've become close friends. Uh, they associate in the same social circles. There, there may be a multitude of reasons why a leader would choose to play favourites. However, it's what dumb leaders do. Let me share a story. I knew a leader once who played favourites. And he favoured one member of his six senior executive team over everybody else. Now, the drama was the leader that he favoured was the worst performing leader in the team. And everyone else knew that. The, the results don't lie. The results are there and they're visible. The behaviours don't lie because the behaviours are seen. But because of some connection that the, that the boss had with this leader, he became the golden child. He became the golden boy. And as a result, the team performance lessened. So as a leader, you want to be rewarding good performance. You want to be developing your best people. But you don't want to be playing favourites. You don't want to overlook bad behaviours and bad results just because they're your friend or that they are your favourite. Because dumb leaders do that. Great leaders develop their team based around the performance and the behaviours that, they, that, 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 that the company would like. So my name's Tony Curl from Think and Grow Business. This is another episode in What Dumb Leaders Do. Until our next one, I'll see you then.